Hello, hi. I think I'm gonna do a day in the life. Uh, yeah, cool. <laughs> That's what we're doing. So, um, I, this cat, she's like, just keeps trying to attack me. Look at her. What? Please stop. Anyways, I've already started the coffee. I just heard the kettle stop. Um, so I'm gonna make myself some coffee and then I think I'm gonna get outside. Ooh, the lighting. Because it is a beautiful day in Vancouver. We have snowy, oh, let me zoom in for you. We have snowy mountains in the distance, the ocean, and almost blue skies, which is something to be excited about in Vancouver. Also, Sam and I put up our tree yesterday, so I'm gonna plug it in so you guys can see it because it's beautiful. shooting for so I keep it's been longer than it should have been but I keep waiting for like reasonably nice days because there's a couple shots that I want to get that kind of require nice days um, but I'm shooting for a company that um, that I will link down below because it's a really cool company and it's based out of Vancouver here um, it's Pacific Packers coffee it's basically like a travel coffee packet um, that you can use when you're camping when you're hiking um, and it's just like super handy and it's like no mess. You can, you can just pack away the filter and put it back in your bag um, and then just like bring it home and throw it out. So I'm shooting a, an advertisement basically for them. Um, and I want to get a couple shots in the park today and also down at the beach. I had a cool idea that I'm gonna have to figure out, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing this morning and I gotta get out there before the sun goes away. I'm lucky I woke up early enough to see the sun. A lot of the time it's like sunny in the morning in Vancouver, but then it goes away later in the day. And then a lot of the time it actually comes back for sunset, which is pretty funny. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing today. Uh, my training for today is basically just a stretching routine. Although I'll probably do a little bit of strength training, um, some like very specific strength training drills. Uh, it depends how I'm feeling, but I feel great right now. Um, I don't feel sore. I just had to check. <laughs> I don't feel sore. I actually feel really good and I want to keep training. So I'll probably wait, see if I get sore throughout the day, see how I feel after my stretching routine, and then possibly do some little strength training. But for now, we've got time and we've got sun. So we are heading out to the park. So I've got my camera stuff. Oh, I've got some gum set up for myself. Great job. Um, well, I'm gonna go shoot. Let's go on a little adventure. fantastic because coffee but also not so fantastic because I just keep drinking the coffee because I make it and then I don't want to waste it <laughs> so it's great I have so much energy luckily that one was a decaf so helicopter I'm gonna try and get some drone shots and then I think I'm gonna go into the park to get more shots with the actual product. So that's the plan.
returned from shooting and spent most of the day um, editing, naturally, <laughs> um, which is exciting because it means that I'm getting closer to actually having a couple kind of fun videos done um, and more, I guess, business related videos because I'm making them for something other than my YouTube channel, which is exciting um, and it's good and it means that um, I can maybe start to find some work that way. And I am just kind of like trying to organize myself basically because when you work for yourself, not that I do work for myself yet because technically, I mean, I get some money from YouTube, but like as far as other stuff goes, um, not so much. But lately I've been trying to organize kind of um, my documents and my media kit and kind of just like developing more of a system as far as making videos goes for me. Because if I'm going to be doing that for other people, there are, you know, forms that you need signed and it's good to have a media kit, both for YouTube and more of like um, a, uh, what's it called? Like a videographer portfolio and something that, and like a rate card that lists how much you charge. And all of these like things that basically make your hobby more of a business, I guess. So I've been working a lot on that and trying to organize that kind of thing. And I actually wanted to talk to you guys about a company that reached out to me. I've worked with them before um, on a PDF um, software. They reached out again because they have some new software that's actually really great for what I'm trying to organize right now. So um, it is from Wondershare and they've basically created some new software, including the Wondershare document cloud. And the main features are cloud storage. So you can store all of your documents. You can access them from whatever device you want. And they also have privacy measures in place so that you can keep them safe. And then they also have to go along with that software for electronic signatures, which are great because Honestly, e-signatures are where it's at. It's what people do, um, it's how people function. And I feel like uh, physical signatures aren't really, like it's a lot, it, it's almost a lot to ask these days <laughs> to try and like get an, or a physical signature from someone. So e-signatures are just so easy. It's such a great way to handle your documents. And with the Wondershare document cloud, you can keep all of your documents in the cloud and you can also use it to collect those electronic signatures since the software handles both of those features so for example i'll just show you guys quickly with a example template let's do like a rental agreement just something generic so basically you when you log into your wondershare document cloud you can go and browse all of your documents you can upload new documents so that you have all of the ones that you need signed in there and so you have them handy so you could just send them out whenever you need to they also sort based on the status of the document so if someone signed it if they're waiting for your own signature if they've declined a signature if you need to send it to a bunch of people or create your own template. There's a lot of different features so that you can kind of manage all of your work regardless of what the actual document needs to be. So once you've uploaded your template, you can go ahead and review it, make sure it's got everything there and it's all formatted correctly. You can also log into your Wondershare document cloud from any device and download it onto the current device you're on if you need to go and access it since it's just stored online anyways. So then you can go and request signatures under the sign tab from either your computer or the documents that you already have live online, which is great because it means that you can store your regular, like your classic, like a general NDA for people if you need one of those, um, kind of just like a terms document and you can keep those all on your Wondershare cloud and then easily send them out for signatures directly from the same platform, which is super handy. Um, you can also customize it to like your own branding. You can customize the subject line and, and the content when you actually request that signature. You can also place the fields throughout the document showing people where to sign or where to enter dates or titles, companies, that kind of thing, or even a custom item. So you can place those where you need them. I'm just gonna place a general signature for now so that you, I can show you guys how that works. You can review it and then you can send it off for the signature. So it's got your activity summary. You can see who needs to sign it still, if it's been completed, that kind of thing. So then the person that you sent it to will obviously sign it, or if they choose not to, they will decline the signature and that it will also let you know if they've declined. But if they do sign it, your summary will update to say that the signature has been completed and that the document is ready to go. So yeah, it's got a lot of great features. And if you guys are interested in checking it out, um, and giving it a shot, it is new software, so you can kind of like see if you like that better than software that you have now maybe, and just just like give it a test, can never hurt. 
Um, I will leave the link to all of the information down below in the description box and you guys can give it a shot there. Now I am going to um, edit, continue editing, because that's what I do, and then I'm gonna go and do Sam's dance class today. So I'm gonna go do a dance class, I think, get some, get some of my um, energy out, and then I'll film it for you guys, and I'll show you, and I'll probably layer over some non-copyright music because I will get copyrighted for whatever song we use. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do after I edit some more, woo! Okay, editing out here is pretty nice because I have this beautiful Christmas tree here and it makes me happy. So that's all that matters. <laughs> like a thousand times before, can't take this anymore. Cause I've been looking for something to change thoughts into motion. Been waiting way too long. Oh, yeah, waiting. Just for somebody to love and to surround me And to handle my emotions I was out waiting for something And if I close my eyes It's all been a waste of time I was out driving every mile And now if I've been wise It's all been a waste of time I just realized that I didn't finish off the video, but that's fine. I'll just do a quick outro now while I'm editing. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed kind of a day in my life um, as an unemployed individual who is trying to earn money from her hobbies. But yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed that little day in the life. Um, I will maybe do another one soon. I don't know, all my days are different. So it's kind of fun to do day in the life right now. And actually stay tuned because I think I'm gonna do Vlogmas. I may as well, like I don't see why not. So yeah, stay tuned for that. That's vlogging every single day of December leading up to uh, Christmas. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to smile and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.